The reproduction process is a vital process that aims to secure the existence and continuity of living organism species by producing new individuals of the same species to prevent them from extinction. Types of reproduction in plants are, sexual reproduction through male and female reproductive organs in the flowers, and asexual reproduction through the various vegetative parts of the plant except for flowers. The flower the flower is the organ of sexual reproduction in flowering plants, it is a short stem whose leaves are modified to form reproductive organs which in turn form seeds inside fruits. The flower arises from a floral bud that emerges from the axle of a leaf called a bract. The bract is the green leaf, where the floral bud emerges from its axle and developed into a flower. The axle may carry some flowers which are known as an inflorescence. An inflorescence is a group of flowers carried on the same axle. Structure of the flower When you examine a flower, you will notice that the flower has a thin pedicle that ends in a swollen part that carries the floral leaves in four different floral whorls. The receptacle is the swollen part upon the flower pedicle, on which the floral leaves exist. The calyx is the first whorl of the floral leaves, it consists of a group of green leaves, and each leaf is called the sepal. The calyx protects the inner parts of the flower especially before blooming. Corolla is the second whorl of the floral leaves, it follows the calyx, it consists of a group of bright colored scented leaves, and each leaf is called a petal. Corolla protects the reproductive organs, it attracts insects to the flower, which helps in the reproduction process. The andresium is the third whorl of the floral leaves, it follows the corolla, it is the male reproductive organ of the flower, its leaves are known as stamens. The stamen consists of the fine filament that ends in the anther. The anther is divided into two chambers containing pollen grains. Andresium produces pollen grains, inside the pollen chamber. Gynesium is the female reproductive organ of the flower. It is the fourth whorl of the floral leaves. Its leaves are known as carpels which resemble a flask in shape. Each carpel consists of a swollen part called the ovary. Ovary is connected with a tube called the style, which ends in an opening called the stigma. Gynesium produces ovules, inside the ovary. Typical flower the flower is considered a typical flower if it contains four different floral whorls. The petals of the corolla are colorful and scented to attract insects to the flower which helps in the sexual reproduction process. The andresium is the male reproductive organ of the flower as it produces pollen grains. The gynesium is the female reproductive organ of the flower as it produces ovules. Sex of flowers Flowers are classified into two types which are bisexual flowers and unisexual flowers. Bisexual flower, hermaphrodite, carries both male and female reproductive organs, such as flowers of flax, tulip, petunia, and wallflower. Unisexual flower carries female or male reproductive organ only, such as flowers of palms, maize, and pumpkins. Thank you for watching if you like this content. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video.